Young Hollywood today in the studio. We have six foot eight, 330 pounds NFL lineman, Ty Inseki. Welcome to the studio. Thank you for having me. Man, six eight is incredible. Yeah, I've slimmed up a little bit. I'm like 315 right now. Okay, you're 315. Yeah. Okay, yeah. so the internet has it wrong. Yeah, that was that was a couple years ago. Off season right now, 315. Exactly. exactly. Okay, so you've been putting in the work. Oh, I got a point to prove. You know, I got the big contract, so now I got to go out there, prove them work. Live up to it. Exactly. I just want to do a little hand test here. Okay, I got you. This is like a, you have a bear's <laughs> hand right here. <laughs> I call that the pause of life. Yeah, that's those are the money makers right there, right? Yeah, yeah, well, yeah, for the most part. Uh, you have a charity event, a golf charity event, right? Yes, yeah, so on. Uh, I've been trying to like envision you on the course. Are you just crushing, demolishing these balls? No, you, know, you got to be finesse with it. You know, okay. golf is a finesse game. So, it is very. Yeah, finesse. I learned. I learned that you can't hit the ball that hard. Oh, you got the driver though, right? Like, you got, I mean, but you got a finesse way into it. You know. Do, do they first? Do they even make? clubs like your size i don't know i don't have any custom so hopefully they have some so wait you've been golfing before but I've you played with before. the smaller clubs yeah yeah so oh, okay you know, so I you're guess, putting yourself at a I disadvantage I a right now yeah. <laughs> okay yeah i could appreciate that yeah so tell me a little about the charity though it's all okay um well this is the first annual golf tournament uh, tournament and the the goal is to raise money because i want to do a gala and i want to give away some scholarships to some kids. Okay, so you're going to put like a spring. little art show together and uh, all that? Well, you know, I got a guy, my jeweler. Okay. You know, I'm going to get some uh, Yeah, I see you yeah, got some yeah, ice right now. Yeah, I'm going to get my, he's going to put some jewelry on display and have a silent auction for it. Okay, I love so it. So hopefully that'll raise a little money. Can we, let's talk about this piece right here. Okay. What well, is that? This is uh, my son. So it says established 2016, Tyler C. and Saki. And it's and, a crown, right? Yeah. You know, and then on the back it says the Inseki Legacy. Love it, man. Yeah. So. so that was a big purchase after uh, your brand new big contract, or? No, nah, I've had this for a while. I've had okay. this for about since he was born. Oh, wow. Yeah, the big purchase was my, by my mama's house. Back in Texas? Yeah, back in Texas, yeah. Okay. Let's talk about your journey to the NFL, first of okay. all. It's a pretty incredible story. Mm -hmm. You uh, undrafted, yeah. bounce around from Arena League, yeah. right? And then yeah. joined the practice squads here and there. Mm -hmm. Never really had your shot. and. Uh, I believe it was 25. The Indianapolis Colts called me, uh, 2012, and that's when they gave me a tryout, and I went over there and they signed me. In that moment, 25, a lot of people would call it quits, right? Yeah, well, you know, I wanted to, but I had some good people in my corner saying, you know, keep pushing, this is what you wanted, wanted to do, this is what you need to be doing. So that kind of gave me the motivation to keep going. What did you, what, like, what did you learn from that process of like, jumping around from arena, arena league and all that. And like, y'all don't know, I feel like there was like, it took a while for you to finally get your shot. And there's a lot of ups and downs yeah. of like missed opportunities. Well, I mean, you know, I've had a lot of adversity off the field as well. Okay. So I mean, you know, the times I've been cut, the times I've been hurt, you know, I was just like, okay, learn from that. Next time I won't do it this way. Or, you know, I got to change up this regimen, how I train. It's got me this far, you know, learning from those mistakes, learning from those, those trials and tribulations. As a lineman, mm -hmm. who's someone that you like, looked up to and like emulated your style play. Flozell Adams, cause you know, he's a big guy. You know, when he put his hands on people, it pretty much was over. Okay. I'm the same way. I put my hands on people. I pretty much nullified them. Yeah. So, you know, same type of mauler type attitude type style. You just recently signed with the Buffalo Bills. Mm -hmm. Why, you had, a, I'm sure you had a lot of options at this point. I did. Uh, what made you pick Buffalo well, over all these other teams? The values that they are trying to bring about, you know, the culture that they're trying to bring about. You know, they, they brought in a few new free agents, yeah. trying to change of the vibe that's up there. You know, we're trying to do something special. So I, I felt that and, you know, I bought into that. So, you know, that's the main reason why I decided to go with them. And then you'll be blocking for... Josh Allen. And then McCoy, Shady. Yeah, Shady's back there. And Frank Gore's back there, too. It's going to be fun. Yeah, two yeah, legends. Right? Yeah, those are my guys, too. Yeah, they're, cool. they're real cool guys. So you've yeah. already, like, been talking to them? Uh, yeah, and... yeah, they brought me in with open arms. So okay. as soon as I got there, you know, they were good. All right, we're going to play a little rapid fire, okay? So okay. just answer the first thing that comes to mind. First one, mm -hmm. favorite workout song? Get Your Mind Right by Jeezy. Why? It takes me back to when that song first came out and where, where I was at in, in life where that song first came out. Where were you? I was doing things, you know, you shouldn't be doing. <laughs> okay. <laughs> favorite cheat meal? Mm, pizza. Pizza, yeah, like favorite topping is just cheese? Uh, pepperoni and jalapenos. Oh, yeah. yeah, mine too. And I gotta add wings with it. 
Okay. Yeah. I don't do the wings part, I gotta but the... Sure. Yeah, I got to cheat. I'm going all in. Okay. Yeah. Is it like, <laughs> do, you, do you get like two larges? Cause... Nah, I don't need that much. I need like a large. <laughs> it's a cheat meal. It's like eight pieces of wings. I feel like I'm eating a large myself. All drums. I mean, okay. you know, I because you got the wings too. Okay. You, know, you got yeah, yeah, the wings, yeah. yeah. Last thing you do before a game. Swag check. You got to look right. Got to. Got to look right. Look good, play good. If you could be any superhero, who would it be? I'm going to say Thanos. See, I never saw Avengers, so I don't even know who Thanos is. I haven't either, but I've really? seen like the, the memes. Yeah. I've seen the memes. Uh, yeah, I don't know. He's got a big face, though. Yeah, I don't he's know. a big man. He's a big guy. OK, I guess Thanos. He's, yeah, he's OK. Big. All right, that makes sense. If you could block for any NFL legend. Quarterback, uh, Peyton. I'd like running to see back. what it was like, yeah. Okay, what about running back? Running back? Uh, well, I block for one of the greatest, you know, Adrian Peterson. Oh, yeah? Yeah, that was fun. Ooh, yeah, yeah, That was yeah. fun. The way he runs, how hard he runs, he makes you want to block harder. I told him, I just want to be at the Hall of Fame speech. I just, I don't even want to, I just want to be there. What record did he break last uh, year? Most touchdowns. Most touchdowns. Yeah. Uh, was there any, like, special thing you guys got? He got you? Yeah, he got us some scooters, those bird scooters. Okay, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah he got us those. Those are pretty cool. And lastly, mm -hmm. if you win a Super Bowl, mm -hmm. How are you celebrating? I don't know. I don't know if we can. So the trip to on, Vegas is. I don't, it? I don't know if we can say that on TV. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Uh, if I win a Super Bowl, that's gonna be it's gonna be a celebration for about a month. Bottles popping. A lot of bottles popped. Yeah, it's All gonna right. be a great time. Well, hopefully this uh, we could see that happen this year. Yeah, hopefully, hopefully. Time in. Appreciate your time. Appreciate you having me. Thank you. Thank you.